Yeah, Macy getting so many photos and videos still into the newsroom about this storm that actually produced a really impressive water spout over the Great South Bay before moving onshore. We'll show that to you in just a second. First, though, we're going to start you off with the radar and things have definitely turned much quieter, but it was a bumpy afternoon and evening for us with these strong to severe thunderstorms rolling their way through Nassau through Suffolk County. That was the storm that produced the water spout and the, uh, the tornado warning uh, through Calverton. It's now weakened uh, quite a bit back to the west. You can see we're looking at dry conditions overall. A few showers across Nassau, but we still have another round to go before we're all said and done. So again, all the radar is fired up and we're going to be here with you all evening long in case another severe warning pops up. But right now that chance is looking pretty slim. I think the worst of the weather is over. I want to show you some of the viewer photos and, and videos that we got because they were incredible. This water, this first one coming into us from a gentleman by the name of Kevin. So this was taken from Fire Island looking out across the South Shore and there's that water spout there and we have many more photos and videos to show you. This one taken by Nicole Walters. This was taken from Shirley. Now I, I know it looks like the tornado is on the ground, but this is looking past the tree line. So that would be the Great South Bay beyond the trees. So this is the water spout actually over the water. And this probably the most impressive thing I've seen. This is from Michael Baruso. This was a video taken right as that water spout was happening. This was taken from the Fire Island Pines around 340 this afternoon. So you could see how impressive that was a very well defined and a very strong water spout. All of these photos and videos of the same storm. And this is the storm that produced that tornado warning through Suffolk County. So the storm lost its rotation briefly. That's why it wasn't warned as this storm came on shore. And then when the rotation tightened up again, they reissued that warning. So thank you so much to everyone that sent in the photos and videos. We're going to talk more about our uh, weather going into the rest of the week. And we're also going to have an update on the track of Hurricane Dorian all ahead in just a few minutes. Macy. Yeah,